Hey y'all, today we're going to In Silico. Okay y'all, so we are in In Silico or on In Silico. I'll try to put the um, SL slurl down for anybody who is not SL that want to come here that didn't know about it but it's also in the destinations role play tab anywho all of these little numbers behind us is a different place for you to go um, on this land or in these different realms we are doing it a little different I really want y'all to be able to experience SL the way that I do because I know a lot of times people are like we don't understand why people um, like SL so much the people that do like SL um, it's such a pleasant break from the typical SL Sims although they are still beautiful beaches and um, fantasy like enchanted things they come a dime a dozen in SL everybody does them they just do it in different ways you either gonna have a beach scene it's either gonna be fantasy whimsical um winter because that's just the season um you don't get a lot of this you don't get a lot of this i like that going into each different realm you get to see so many different things and it just it's grunge yet it has an air of luxury to it if that even makes sense y'all so i i was wondering whether or not i was gonna get on um, black dragon like i used to come on black dragon just to like take pictures and stuff like that but now i'm really um enjoying black dragon i didn't think i was gonna be able to work it correctly because i just felt like okay i'm not about to be able to learn like the hot keys and stuff like that but i really was i really have been able to and i'm so very proud of myself so i'm like let me just see take my time and just come on here kind of like a stream but not a stream but just to show y'all like how I experience SL, I like to explore in places like this. I I'll be on here for too long exploring. It's just so nicely made. I always look at this stuff and I'm like, somebody made this. Like somebody who has family who probably doesn't even know that they're able to do stuff like this. Like he over here in a damn vending machine don't know what to get same old same old and then throughout they had these little carport things these little things right here and you can grab you like a little free rental and ride around but for now we just gonna we just gonna walk around this ain't the car this is just a car that's here so we'll walk around for a little bit but some of the lands they're about this big and then some of the lands are bigger and so that's what i love about it you never really know what you're gonna get when you go to these different um quote unquote these different realms so let's go back and then we'll go to a different one so like i said i, I bopped around i definitely did because i was in awe first of all and then secondly i wanted to have some nice spaces so that you guys could really get like a feel and understanding as to like what is really happening here i just love it this is one of my we can go to the beginning it ain't really much over here but just so y'all can see it's been a while since i've been wowed by a land and i've gone to a lot of nice lands i've showed y'all a lot of a lot of nice lands but this land truly wow me such a great use of vertical space such an awesome use of vertical space now up and through here it's a um it's a naked holograph lady i was i don't know if i'm gonna have to blur her out i don't know if youtube gonna start acting funky with me i don't know but we shall see look how cool this look am i tripping Am I tripping? I mean, flowers and stuff is nice, but this is cool too. I like how they made the little jetpacks, like a little, like a little robot BBL. Let me find out. Let me find out. Even in the future, 
BBLs done evolved once again. So they got like little places like this. When I tell y'all, I be having a ball. Me and my little introverted self be having a ball. Just being up in here. Yeah, we finna see cursors and all of that. Cause that's that's what we on. This 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 go around. The thing that be tripping me out though is the fact that these places be so highly detailed, but it don't never be nobody on here. As many people that's logged into that is logged into SL right now, they do not they don't be on here. And they buy backdrops to take pictures. Why wouldn't you come someplace like here and take a picture? Who gives a damn if it take all day? Hell, don't nobody be over here no way. I can't tell you how many times I've come to this land and I have not run into one person. Not one person. Watch watch a person come now to, to prove me wrong. But even still, look how cool these are. I had these little robots and I'm like... Stuff like this could happen in real life. And I don't think people just really respect that idea enough. I just, I don't. I think people just kind of feel like this type of shit is absurd. Like there will never come a day where it'll be something like this. Standing at a door like this to let us into who knows where. And I, I feel like... I don't feel like it's absurd. I don't. But I look at this and I'm like, somebody made these stairs. Somebody came on, made this texture, learn how to deal with mesh, learn how to convert it over so you can put it in SL. Hold up, let me move my little thing. It's like amazing. I spent so much time over here. I knew exactly where I wanted to take it out. I'm like, I really want y'all to get like the full feel. This is the little rental car thing. I might get a car after uh, we come out from up over here, but I don't know. Look at this. Talk about um, shift leader. It's the damn Transformers robots in disguise ass get up. It ain't nothing that you telling them to do where you would need this big ass suit. It ain't nothing. You just really want to seem intimidating. And then you get down to you the same damn size. And he don't give a damn. Sir right here. He don't give a damn. This young man over here, he's working. He's doing what he needs to do. He's getting the job done. But him over here... He don't give a damn about shift leader. Shift leader is not. Shift leader is not bothering him. Not one bit. But yeah y'all so. I found this land. Was it yesterday? I ain't gonna get a car right here. Cause I think it's something else. I found this place. I think it was yesterday. It was either yesterday or the day before. And I was like OMG. I got to show my people this. It's so nice. This was like a little like a homeless encampment when i drove down here i was like what the hell and then look at this because i'm telling you i knew where i wanted to take y'all i said because this shit was wild look at this a damn homeless alien what with a with a goddamn what the fuck is that a muffler a fan it's like it it, it bet this better not be no goddamn like fruition type shit I bet the hell not see no damn homeless aliens on the street never this like a homeless homeless in cabin this type of shit where you be feeling some type of way cause you just be thinking about the fact that there are places where this is the safest place for some homeless people to be it's like yeah it's cars and stuff but that's all it is we ain't gotta worry about other people doing the most Cause we don't have no place to sleep. Like what the hell? Did we come this way? We already came this way. This uh number three for me is my favorite. They have beautiful artwork. So number number three is my favorite. I think because it is it seems like it's the biggest to me, but I don't know if it's really the I don't know if it's really the biggest. But each one of these go into the next level. So, like, you could be walking and then they'll have, like, all of these, this ramp that you can drive up and down. 
and so you might end up on the sixth floor from the third floor from from level three you might go to, to level six or some shit like that you just you just never really know but look at this look at this am i tripping am i trip i don't feel like i don't feel like i'm tripping i don't i feel like this is as amazing as i feel like it is and that y'all feel this way too I'm like completely wild, completely wild by this land. The pictures, insane. Futuristic pictures would go crazy. People love pictures in SL. They, lo they love a good picture. Love to take a damn picture in SL. And they sitting on platforms and they got this shit free any backdrop multiple backdrops and people like no let me stay on the land what what look at the detail are you kidding me this is what i did all yesterday all yesterday this is what i did just in complete awe could can't believe it still can't believe it they have done a lot of nice Sims in SL. Do not get me wrong. But this, this by far for me is one of my favorite. The whole setup in itself, I feel like, is top notch and next level. They let you run with your imagination. They let you be as kiddish as you want to be if you want to get in the car and just drive for an undisclosed amount of time they'll let you do that they'll let you do that the way everything is just so meticulously put together nothing was by chance like look at this I can't get enough of it. I had a whole different video plan for today in a whole different way. Look at this. We're gonna we're gonna get up in there. It was a video that I had that I was gonna do in a whole different way. It wasn't I wasn't even gonna be here. But when I tell you after I found this place. I was like, I got to, I got to show them. Oh, I hit the mic. Hopefully that didn't sound crazy. So then they had this little thing. These elevators, some take you up, some take you down. Um, But they all take you somewhere. Somewhere new, somewhere interesting. Look at this. Look at this. It's giving Star Trek. That's what it's given, you know. Star Trek it was a Star Trek. The the goodness of it. It's what it's given. I thought y'all might enjoy this, you know. I ain't trying to recruit nobody to come to SL, but like it was this one lady. She said it, she put it together so well for me. Hold on, let me find where I need to be. She said SL is expensive to start but not maintain and i agree with that starting sl if you also want a place to stay i would recommend like 50 dollars to start so it might take you 50 dollars to start but i'm i'm gonna say i'm gonna say 60 70 it depends it depends on where you stay to be honest it really does it depends on where you stay because y'all i'm missing something i knows i am i don't want to have to rent a car if i had a rental car option i would rent a car to get to it but i don't see the damn rental car option anywho because if you get you can get a house 
but if it's not furnished then you're gonna need furniture can I fall down where it's gonna put me though I don't know so NSL I do agree I don't know where I just fell to I do agree that it takes it definitely takes some money to start and have your avatar looking decent and stuff like that not so much so that you can compete but just so that you can compare now <laughs> now um just so that you could like what you're looking at because yeah you could get a little basic you know one two buckle my shoe but then that's what it's gonna look like so then when you go out and you see uh somebody with queen in their name and she out here looking muy elegante. Then you're gonna be like, "Why I ain't put more money into my?" Yeah, you you're gonna, you're gonna, and you're not done for doing it. You done for doing an absurd amount. Yeah, that's dumb. Don't do that. But it's a lot of people that do. It's a lot of people that put a crazy amount of money into SL. For whatever dumbass reason. But I don't know. Hold up. So let's go back. Because I can't find a place. How to get over there. And my feelings is hurt behind that. Hold up. Nobody is occupying the space. Either they don't know about it. Or they don't care. But I care. And I feel like these people go through a lot to put these lands together. Like look at this cool elevator. People put a lot of time into this. And so I hope that I just don't be catching people at the right time. And that's the real reason why. Because this is so nice. I feel like it's crazy that it's a lot of people that don't get to share in this. You know what I'm saying? Like really don't get to enjoy this. Look at this do a little run a little a little runny jog like look at this i love stuff like this i love the fantasy i love the beaches i love the enchanted landscape scaping landscaped sims i love that but this this futuristic techno cyberpunk you don't get a lot of this and, and when you get it it's never to this magnitude it has really been a while since i have been thoroughly impressed by a lamb but in 2024 in silico uh, has set the bar as to where i don't even i don't even know what could be done that could make a land better it's it's not enough flowers it's not enough fantasy that would in my opinion compare to how this place has been put together i'm amazed i'm amazed and then i'm now on black dragon which i never thought that i would use black dragon i just kind of felt like black dragon was a little bit too overly complicated and i'm like it doesn't really need to be so i told myself i said you know what for graphics i could bring out better um graphics i really wanted um to learn how to use it so like for these past couple of days i've been heavy when i tell y'all heavy i've been heavy on getting to know this my this my outfit of the day y'all of getting to know black dragon and the ins and outs of black dragon and when i tell y'all it's given i'm never leaving because the graphics the lighting the endless options for settings i mean you get a lot of that in the firestorm viewer but on here it just it really hits different it really hits different 
everything really lights up. I don't know. I, I be on here with y'all all day looking at all of these. If y'all with Second Life, definitely come through. I don't know how long this is going to be here. Um, I just found it the day before yesterday. It's fa It has to be fairly new because I check the destinations for new places. So, if this is where we end, this is where we end, my friend. This is in Silico. Yeah, I think we I think we're going to be done. Ain't no better way to end.